Neil here, just a quick update, about eight days ago I damaged a disc in my lower spine, it's nothing serious, um, it's not a slip disc, it's just an injury, compressed it and it's causing nerve ending issues into my right leg and it's causing spasming and I, I can't really put a lot of pressure on to my right hand side and it hurts like hell. Mrs. Ryder Skulls has had to dress me on a couple of occasions. It is improving under the guidance of my physio, which is great. The downside is I can't ride my bike, uh, at least until I've got some confidence that I can hold the thing up. And the problem being is if I was knocked off or I fell off, I couldn't pick it up. If I come to a set of traffic lights and I need, for whatever reason, to use my right leg to prop me up, I could fall over, it could give way. And again, I couldn't pick it up quite embarrassing and also very debilitating and I don't really want to risk damaging the bike or myself and causing a longer term injury and so I'm stuck here now wondering well, what can I put on the channel now crossed my mind in years gone by that I've seen people maybe new motorcyclists struggling getting their bikes onto centre stands and a lot of that in fact, the vast majority of that is down to technique and three or four simple things you need to look at. Certainly three. And it basically means that there's no real exertion required for any bike these days. They're all, all bikes that have got centre stands have got a decent amount of design put into them. In times gone past, if you've got any old Kawasaki GTR thousand owners, that might have had a bike like that way back when. They were a pig to put on to the centre stand, but nowadays they're all pretty good. And it's just down to technique and knowing what to do. And there's possibly three things in total, like I say, to put in place as you put your bike onto the centre stand. And it is very, very easy, even with a knackered disc in your back. And I'm gonna show you, despite what a physio might wanna think, Let's give it a whirl. Point one, look down. Level place to put your bike, okay? Ultimately, you need level ground and somewhere that's solid. If you find that you're not on a level surface, you're ideally best using your side stand. If it's not level on a center stand, it could topple, wouldn't be great. If you're going to put your front soft ground and you're using your side stand, another good thing to do, if you haven't got a little platform, sometimes you used to, you used to be able to get like a little plastic disc that you put underneath for your side stand to stop it sinking into any soft ground. The other thing is, if you get a can of pop, squash it, use that, it spreads the area for your side stand so it doesn't sink into the ground. Quick tip that. Second consideration, front wheel. It has to be straight, okay? Handlebar straight. If you try to put your bike back onto its center stand and your handlebars are like that, you're gonna be fighting against whichever direction your bike wants to go. Make sure that your handlebars are, in fact, like that and your front wheel is indeed straight. Third, you see your stand, you've got a radius here. Both sides, one there, one there. They both need to be touching the ground before you start trying to put the bike up onto its centre stand. I'll show you. That's your radius there on either side of your centre stand legs. That's where it needs to be. So you've got a level ground, you've got your front wheel straight, and at that point, you can pressure your lever there with your foot so you keep your left leg straight and you straighten your, your, your right leg will be bent when it's there. And all you need to do is just basically pull up on the bike and straighten your right leg. Like so. Simple. One more time. So once you're happy you've got good ground, your front wheel is straight, you've got your centre stand, 
to there, you have your left leg straight, you've got your lever with your foot on it as such, and you're happy that your both radiuses are touching the ground. You just straighten your right leg and put pressure down with your right foot while slightly lifting up and back with your bike. That's how you put your bike up on a centre stand. So basically, even with a dodgy disc in your back, you should be able to put your bike onto its centre stand. It's about technique. Just remember them three things and you'll be halfway there. Solid ground, straight front wheel, and make sure both your radiuses underneath your centre stand are touching the ground before you exert any pressure onto the lever and lift your bike up onto the centre stand. Should be good to go. Thanks for watching.